Well, welcome back, guys. As you can see, I have my husband. I don't want to do this. <laughs> Somehow, I have convinced him to allow me to do his makeup. How? I don't know. He's like being extra nice today. I think she that's asked why. nicely. Yeah, so I, think I, think it's, I think it's just because he's being really nice today. But for those of you who do not know me or do know me from like the CTFXC daily vlogs that we both film on every single day. Click Link right in here. the description. <laughs> you know that I kind of suck at makeup. I have no idea what I'm doing. Half the time I don't even know what makeup products are called. Am I putting it on right? I don't know. Does it work for me? I hope so. Little is better, I think, sometimes yes. with makeup. I, you know what? I do try. Don't get me wrong. I try really hard. But anyways, I don't really know what I'm doing with makeup. So yeah, I'm just going to do what I do know on him. <laughs> Wait, are you going to actually try to do it? Yeah, I'm going to I'm actually going to do my husband's makeup today, whether he <laughs> wants to or afraid. not. I'm so, uh, afraid. yeah, if I um use products the wrong way, go ahead and judge me right down below in that comment section. Let me know. Tell her everything she's doing wrong. Tell me everything I'm doing wrong. And right. So, we cleaned his face. And now, and I'm I took a shower. This. It's by Origins and it's called a Perfect World Age Defense Treatment Lotion with white tea because we're getting older. Wait, it's white tea? White tea. So can you drink that? I would say no, because I don't think anybody should drink any type of face products. Is that on my face? That's on your face. That's pretty gross. Usually what I do is I wash my face, I put that toning lotion on, and then I put a all over nice lotion on my face. And then I usually put on this, the Ultimate Eye Cream by Olay, and I love it, and I start by it. And it's Olay! Amazing. Yes! Olé, 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 olé. And it's amazing. Look at Ow, it's in my eye. Oh, it is not your big turn. He's, poke, he's poking my ear up. Now I'm going to put on some Photo Finish Foundation Primer by Smashbox on that pretty little muggin. Babe, you are going to look so good. You're glowing. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and put on a foundation. I don't really know what your tint is. We have so many different choices here. I like how you're genuinely trying to do this. I don't really know what I'm doing because I kind of suck at makeup, but you know. I'm happy to be the guinea pig there, right? I know, babe. I'm very lucky because half of his face is covered in hair, so I don't really have to worry if it's that bad. Yeah, I suppose I was wondering if I had to shave my beard. I have a question for you. Most girls wear makeup all the time, and you know, you kind of get used to the way that it feels on your skin, and you don't feel like if it's heavy or anything. No, it of genuinely sort of... Does feels, it feel heavy or does it, it feel light? It genuinely you? feels like I have like frosting. I don't like using chapstick because it, I don't like the feeling of it on my. Yeah. My mouth. The only time I'll ever use it is like before going to bed. So I just fall asleep. I don't know what's on there. Yeah. I can feel like there's stuff on my. You know, I need to put that beautiful hair back. See, I'm fine. Beautiful. Look at that. It's a photo finish. <laughs> <laughs> Next, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to do uh, his under eyes to brighten them up a little bit. This a is stuff. Stroke of Light. This is actually what I like to use, and it's by Bare Minerals, and it's called Stroke of Light. And it's super light. I love it. It's supposed to be like an eye brightener. My dark. Eyes. Again guys, I don't really know what I'm doing, so remember, this is not a makeup tutorial. This is a <laughs> don't do this. This is just for pure enjoyment. Ow. Oh, you are such a wiener. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I am one of those people that I'll try and go and watch like a makeup tutorial on YouTube. It never turns out the way that the tutorials are, it ever. Is. Like it never looks like it does on the tutorials. Most of them are way too talented. So you would have to do this every day. You don't have to do this every day. I don't do this every day. Well, no, I mean just in general, putting makeup on. Some people feel more confident with makeup, and I think there's nothing wrong with wearing makeup every day because it's about what makes you feel confident and good about yourself. Mm, you're so cute. You're mm. so beautiful. Okay, you can open up your eyes. <laughs> Next what I'm using is Bare Minerals Bare Pro and I I just love this powder. I'm using it in Warm Natural. This is my color obviously, it's not going to probably be fitting for him, but we're just going to dry it anyways. How is this going to come off, all this stuff? You wash it off. Really? I just imagine if I was in the, like the 80s, like 80s, like hair metal bands, like Kiss. I would not want to do that. Hard <laughs> to do. Or even gore. <laughs> gore, oh well, my goodness, that would be crazy. Well, at least they're wearing costumes. Now, the one thing that I have trouble with is contouring. You know, I know you're supposed to do contouring is, with like, I think, is liquid. Is that where you do like Yeah, your I think most people do it with like a liquid foundation, but I don't. Uh, just because I don't really like to wear a heavy foundation. So, <laughs> I just got actually the next two higher up in the Bare Pro for Bare Minerals. Call and the police. It's, it's in toffee, and I just use a little bit underneath my cheekbones, and I, I love it. I, I think it's great, but again, I have no idea what I'm doing with makeup, so, um... Help me. Yeah. 
Help me. I don't even think I'm contouring right, but we're just gonna see what we can do here. I like how you're genuinely trying to do this. You're looking like a babe. I mean, I don't even recognize you. I'm like, who is that hunk of meat on this bed? And now we're gonna put a little blush on. A little rose of teeth on you. Look, look. Ah. <laughs> and it's just. It's the true, uh, true bad points of having makeup on is you don't want to mess it up. Yeah. If you have an itch on your nose, you just gotta let it be. All right, well, we're gonna use this eyeshadow palette from Smashbox, the Smoky Eye Palette. With this, I have no idea what I'm doing, so uh, enjoy. <laughs> I have no idea how to do eyeshadow. This is gonna be really funny. You know what? We're gonna go real crazy with this one. I'm, I'm so slightly nervous. afraid. All right, we're gonna do green. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm slightly terrified. Well, guys, don't hire me to do your makeup. <laughs> <laughs> Spread it like wildfire. Dude, you are looking glamorous. I can genuinely see the difference, and that makes me very scared. What scares me the most is putting eyeliner on something. Oh, this is not gonna be, I'm not gonna like this. This is a tattoo liner by Kat Von D, and it's da bomb, man. It is da bomb. And it's in Trooper, it's so good. Talk to the hand. Okay, close eyes. This is gonna be scary for me. Oh, you look it so cute! You know what I forgot? What? We gotta put some brightener on, and this one is oh, by uh, Becca, and it's the Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed Pata in Champagne. Ooh, summer. look at you! We're gonna do some mascara next, and I love to use uh, Great Lash by Maybelline in the Black is Black. Now we're gonna put on some lipstick. No, what? I didn't say anything about lipstick. <laughs> well, I like to put the, I don't know how to say this name, but it's Caudalie, 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 Caudalie. And uh, it's the lip conditioner. I got it at Sephora. It smells incredible, but it's really good to put on, especially if you're wearing lipstick before you put on your lipstick so it doesn't like clump up or anything of that sort. Oh, it does smell good. Doesn't it smell really nice? Or like just Starburst. in general, like I love wearing it just on my lips plain. It smells like a Starburst. It's nice, it's really light. Don't worry, I'll put everything down below what I used on my husband today. Oh, I'm sorry. What I'm actually using is Kat Von D Hawkwind. This stuff's the jam too. But my favorite is Kat Von D Lolita, which is what I usually wear. I think I'm wearing- She's a tattoo artist, right? I'm wearing it right now, yeah. Next thing that I'm using is the Universal Taupe Brow Master Brow Gel by Bare Minerals. Master Brow. Yep, look, look at these crazy little caterpillars. At least they're not having a party and holding hands like they usually are. <laughs> Oh, like a unibrow. Yeah, like a unibrow. Everything is being highlighted. I can see it on the camera, and I'm a good like three feet away from it. Oh, <laughs> okay, last but not least, let's set this bad boy with the Urban Decay All Nighters uh, Setting Spray. It's great. What does that do? It just set your makeup. Let's see the finished product. Thank you to Charles for letting me attempt to put makeup on his face. You're welcome. <laughs> he's never gonna do it again and he's never gonna trust me again. Oh my god. <laughs> ah, did you enjoy that? No. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, I'm gonna go scrub this off my face right now. Well guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Uh, if you want to see more weird videos like this, make sure that you do list it down in the comment section below. If you are brand new, please do not forget to hit that subscribe button. Also make sure that you do go and subscribe to our daily vlog channel at youtube.com slash ctfxc to see some weird stuff every single day. If you guys want me to do her makeup, please let us know. Don't. Okay. He already did it and it was bad. Oh yeah, I did it. Do was it was terrifying. Yeah, it was terrifying. Alright guys, don't forget to hit that like button and we will see you next time. Bye. Don't try this at home. I'm gonna go burn my face off. <laughs> Alright, bye.